Hey there, you do. So this is part of the quick tips for black hair care video um, series, and it's just about nighttime hair care. So the first thing to do when taking care of your hair at night is to moisturize it so that it doesn't get dry overnight. So I tend to re-moisturize it because it's dried over the daytime. I use a spritz with things like aloe vera juice, water, and glycerin in it, and I just spritz it around my hair. Then the second thing is a style that doesn't allow your hair to get tangled and everywhere so that you need a lot of combing and tangling in the morning because that's not the aim of the game. What I do is a low loose bun, but other people do high loose bun, so a higher bun, and then that way you can lie back and sleep without disturbing the bun and the main body of the hair, or using a braid, either a single braid or two braids on the side, whichever you prefer, um, they work because your hair doesn't get the chance to kind of tangle, go in every different direction. And then finally, is to protect your hair, and this is to protect it from the cotton sheets or cotton pillowcases that you use, because the cotton, when you move against it, even when you're just lying on it, the cotton will dry out your hair. Um, uh, it's absorbent, so it will. So, what I use is a satin scarf. You can also use a silk scarf, because um, they get the same effect, because they're both um, quite smooth and shiny, and they glide over your hair and allow your hair to glide over them, and they don't take out the moisture from it, which is the important part. So the moisturization you did before you go to bed will stay there by the time you wake up in the morning. So this is just a, um, a folded over satin scarf, so it's a big um, square that I fold over and then I put it on and tie it at the back to go to bed. And I learned this um, online at Silver Tube. Um, Fuck I'll try to put a link up so that you can see her album. Um, and, you know, she's also got a YouTube channel, so I'll put up a link for her as well. And here's my satin bonnet with the elasticated edges. But um, I've just got a new satin bonnet because the edges are kind of worn out. I've had it for quite a while. Um, I've had it for about a year, actually probably just a bit more than a year, a year and a half. So this is my new one, and it's kind of standard. I got it for two pounds, um, and the satin bonnet I got for two pounds as well. Sometimes you get it for as much as three, three forty-nine. but shop around and find satin bonnet, and don't, don't believe, um, just check the label, because if it doesn't say satin, it's not satin inside. If it doesn't say silk, it's not silk. So um, those are the things. So for the satin scarf, I used to try wearing the satin scarf, but they'd be off my head by the middle of the night, and I, I'm just too sleepy to, you know, wake up and put it back on and tie it. Yeah. So by using the bonnet when it's, you know, new and the elastic, the elastic still works, it keeps the scarf on your head, and that's what where you want it. And it, the satin bonnet also doesn't fall off overnight. And you don't get a headache in the morning or anything else like that. So I really like it because it's elasticated. Um, so um, that's one thing that I found was really useful. So moisturize, put it in a style that's low manipulation, low maintenance, and then protect it with bonnets or and or scarves. I hope that video was helpful. And um, leave comments, rate, and subscribe. And thanks to all the subscribers who are still watching. All right. Take care.